Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Acer Swift 14 aisf 1461 t To gain access to the internals of this small 14-inch device, you have to undo 10 Torx head screws. Pop the two areas behind the hinges with a thin plastic tool. Then, pry the top corners and the back. The final step is to work your way around the sides and the front. There is a large dust filter in front of the ventilation grill on the inside of the bottom plate. Our machine has the default 65 watt hour unit. A 75 watt hour model is also available for those who are constantly away from the charger. To remove it, Pull the connector towards the unit and undo the two Phillips head screws that hold the battery in place. The capacity is enough for around 14 hours of video playback. Our test was conducted with the battery saver preset activated in the Windows Power and Battery menu and the normal mode applied in the AcerSense app. The Wi-Fi 7 card is replaceable, which is good. The memory is soldered. The modules are hidden underneath a metal cap below the cooling's heat spreader. You get 16 or 32 gigabytes of LPDDR5X, 7,500 MHz RAM in dual-channel mode. The machine that we bought has just a single M.2 slot for 2280 Gen 4 NVMe drives. The SSD is also wrapped in a heat shield. According to Acer, some devices sport two SSD slots. The cooling seems sufficient for an IGPU-only notebook. It has two fans, a pair of long heat pipes, one large top-mounted heat sink, and two small heat spreaders.